Another common feature that you may want to take advantage of on the Avaya IP office system is the use of hunt groups. You may want a hunt group for your sales team or for your technical team so that you have a single number to call and it will ring all of the members of these teams. So in the first instance uh, what we'll need to do is we will need to create a new hunt group on the Avaya. So on the left hand side once you're connected into the management software if you navigate to hunt group you'll see there is already a hunt group creative this hunt group is the default hunt group and can be reused or edited if needed in this instance we're going to create a new hunt group that's only going to contain a selection of users so all we need to do is if we right click in the hunt group pane and create new it'll ask us to give the hunt group a name in this case it's technical and we'll give it an extension of 300 by default on the Avaya IP office system user extensions begin at 201 leaving 200 as a group extension so in this instance we will create our hunt groups in the 300 range so there is a clear separation between what is a hunt group and what is a user once we've given our hunt group an extension number we need to add some members to it you may have difficulty in seeing the section to add new members as the Avaya IP Office software is quite big. You'll have to scroll across as so. Once you've scrolled across, hit the edit button and it will ask you to select which members you would like to be part of this hunt group. So in this, insta this instance, we will select one, two and three. You can use control and click to select multiple extensions in this list. Once you've selected the list, click append and then press OK. You'll now see the other three extensions are in the list with tick boxes next to them. If for any reason you would like to temporarily remove somebody from a hunt group, simply untick the box next to their name and they will no longer receive hunt group calls. When you want to add this person back into the group, simply tick the box again and that user will now receive the calls. You will notice in the default configuration the ring mode is sequential. This means that the phone system will first alert the first extension and then move on to the second extension and then the third extension in sequence. It will not ring all the devices at the same time. To change this behaviour, simply select the drop down box and change to collective. Note that in a collective hunt group, you cannot have multiple entries of the same user. This is a standard message and should not concern you. Now that we have created our hunt group, we've assigned it an extension, given it some members and changed its ring mode, we can press OK in the bottom right hand corner of the screen. To make these changes live, simply hit the save icon in the top left of the screen. I hope you have enjoyed this tutorial. However, if you need any more information on Hunt Group programming on the Avaya IP Office platform, please feel free to contact us.